Anthony, it looks like you guys are coming back to play a uh, preseason game against uh, the Wizards at John Wall here in Rupp Arena. They announced today. Do you know about that? And, and what, what's your reaction to it? Yeah, um, great experience. You know, I come back uh, where we played for me, Darius, and John. You know, to come play here. It's going to be fun. You know, just get back to Lexington, you know, University of Kentucky. Um, you know, it's always great to come back and play uh, where you went to school. So this should be a fun game. Are all you guys going to participate in the charity alumni game? Or, or yeah, I know I am. The rest of you guys? No way. If the money, right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm still in debate right now. Yeah, me too. Debating. <laughs> Have any of you guys been over to the Bill Craft Center and worked out with, with any of the current team and, and any impressions you guys might have of those guys? I've gotten a chance to work out with them. And, um, I'm impressed with Julius Rondo. Um, been back playing pickup, and you know with the Marcus, I'm impressed with Julius and you know, Harrison. Julius and the Harrison twins. Uh, for me, um, I like the Curry Johnson, and uh, on Julius too. Yeah. Everybody, they said. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you guys come back to work this camp? What do you get out of it? Check. Check. I mean, it's a great experience for us. You know, come back, help Coach Kyle out, you know, and be back in Lexington. You know, um, that's why I come back. Um, and I didn't get to come last year. So uh, just come this year, see how it is. Uh, for me, um, I just like being back here. Uh, old memories. Um, all my friends here too, so I don't see why not. Just an excuse for me to come back. So. Michael, when you left here, you talked about how much you were going to miss it. How much, how much have you missed it? <laughs> how much, and how different is life, you know, outside of college? Um, oh, well, in college, um, it was a brotherhood. Now, like, it's just like, I don't know, like, it's just grown men all around me, so, um, I'm just growing up fast. You know, that's about it. Questions? Eric, now, when the previous summons we talked about having a new challenge of taking on a uh, leader or a new part of your career? Um, this is going to be a great experience. You know, playing behind Chris, I uh, learned a lot. Now, you know, get a chance to, you know, play the point, uh, you know, whatever the two. It's just, you know, a great feeling that I get to, you know, orchestrate a little bit. <laughs> so, you know, it's good. like I said, it's going to be a great experience. Do you want to start, you know, Art telling Archie what you expect from him this year? Archie's only 18. Uh, he got a lot to learn, um, and he's still growing. You know, as a you know person too. So, you know, Archie's gonna be a pretty good player, you know, in the league. Anthony, when you look back uh, on that title team and what what you all were able to accomplish, does it still kind of amaze you? I mean, for yourself to come in, for the freshman to come in and really kind of spearhead that effort to the championship. I mean, we came in knowing that we had to play together. You know, it wasn't you know, a one man show. Um, you know, Coach Carroll did a great job, you know, and all the coaches to you know, make sure we left our Eagles at the door and come in and play together. You know, we had great veterans on that team, you know, Terrence, Deron, you know, Darius, you know, and um, we all tried to do it for Darius. You know, he said he wanted to win the ring before he left, so that was like one of our, um, our goals to do for him, and um, it, it was fun, you know, and um, I don't think it really, you know, we haven't grasped the situation yet. You know, um, as far as winning the championship, you know, um, I probably a couple of years from now is really going, you know, really start feeling it. So, uh, uh, but it was great. What do you think about the, the expectations for this year's team with the, all the uh, all Americans? And I mean, it's, how much pressure do you think it's it's on? And, and if you can if you can compare that 
maybe the sum of the expectations you face coming here? No, I mean, this is on a lot of guys gonna try to come after them. You know, um, we got a great team, very talented. So every time they play a team, you know, even the underdogs, you know, team that's not that good, you know, they're gonna try to come after them. So um, they gotta be prepared for that, you know, and uh, make sure they continue to work hard. Yeah, God just spent some time at the national team, the mini camp. What was that experience like? And ultimately, what would it mean to play? I mean, you know, you've been there obviously before, but to make the Olympic team down the road, come to that. Oh, it was great. You know, uh, y'all want to represent the country, you know, especially me at a young age. You know, um, last year was fun. You know, uh, but you know, I'm trying to um, do the same thing this year. And hopefully, uh, I do make it. Um, it was a humbling feeling. You know, I was just even there. I, mean, I was surprised I made the mini game. Too. Well, hoping I make the team. It's true. 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 It's Woo! Um, <laughs> very excited. Um, excited about where our organization is going. I believe we're in the uh, right direction now. And uh, I'm, just, I'm just glad to know where I'll be finally. So um, I, I'm at a comfort level now and I, I'm ready to move forward. Those of you guys that do know that you're going back to the Illinois games, are you guys talking about who's going to win that game yet? We will. Everybody knows we're going to win the game, really. 2010. I say 2010 and we'll, we'll win. Thank you, Eric. You say 2010 and we'll win? Yeah. Glad you're honest. <laughs> Not 2012. We're proven winners. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I ain't got nothing to say to that. <laughs> <laughs> You guys, you got six pros here today. The NBA is now stocked with Kentucky pros. Can you just talk about what Coach Cal has done in such a short time and um, just how impressive he's been? He's a great recruiter. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> Now he gave guys ready for the league. I mean, you know, he I mean he coached in the league before, so it's like he got an upper upper hand and he won his practices like NBA practices, so it makes it a lot easier and a smoother transition going into the league. Did you all last season what were your kind of thoughts while they were struggling? No comment. <clears throat> I didn't get to see much, so I'm not really sure. <laughs> yeah, it was a busy season for me. <laughs> <laughs> play hard. They play hard. Very From young. what I saw, they play hard. Very young. Yeah. Mike, what's the experience been like being so close to a guy that you sort of idolized, Jordan? Oh. Um, I see him like every day, so now like like whatever. But like, uh, oh, when I first got there, I was like, man, I was shocked. Uh, I, mean, I was shocked. Uh, I was number two pick in the whole draft, and uh, and uh, he taught me a lot. Um, I mean, I talked to him like every week, so. Feel like it's a good feeling. The fire is what people talk about. Do you feel like that sort of thing you guys share? Is anybody talk about this? Who, me and MJ? Yeah. I mean, I guess. I mean, <laughs> um, I ain't seen him play like that. But, um, I was little, so I ain't really seen him play. Fire and pickup games, though? <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> you know, I'll see you so comfortable when you're in settings like with kids and, and just playing ball and goofing off in the way that they look at you. Why, why is that so much fun for you know, guys like you to come back and do that kind of thing, just to be around 
you know, kids who, who look at you probably differently than, than most everybody else? Um, basically, we kids ourselves. <laughs> Most people here, like 17, 18, 19. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I don't think people realize that. I mean, me and Eric would have just finished our senior year last year. So we're basically still kids. So when we're around situations like this, I mean, that's what we are, kids. So. Coach, how much do you think you matured now with the time you have in the NBA? I've matured. You said. <laughs> You said he was immature before? <laughs> that's what he implied to Marcus. Let you know. hmm? So that's what he was implying. Oh. I'm mature. <laughs> Marcus, could you elaborate on that? How do you, how do you think you matured? What, what examples can you give us? Well, I'm 22 now. And um, I'm in my fourth season. I'm not mature. Thank you. Appreciate it. We'll get these guys out to the Everyone game. have a wonderful day. Thank you. <laughs>